Good morning, everyone. My name is Paula De Silva, executive chef of 1500 Degrees Restaurant at the Eden Rock Renaissance. And this is my sous chef, Gerard Ladson. And uh, this morning, we're going to be making for you guys um, one of our most popular breakfast uh, dishes at the restaurant. And it's called a Tres Leches Pancake um, with caramelized bananas and some fresh strawberries and fresh blueberries. And um, it's uh, actually really popular because of, you know, all the good stuff, right? There's like oh. rum, <laughs> rum here, rum here. Bananas, bananas sugar, sugar sweet, cream, condensed, milk. condensed milk. So um, some really delicious stuff. So we're going to start uh, with the pancake. Um, and uh, hopefully we can get this right. So you want to always use like a nonstick pan uh, for your pancakes, which helps if you have trouble like flipping it and, and, and sticking and things like that. Or, you know, have a pancake like maker or griddle. What are they called? Griddle. 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 All right. So um, start with a little spray in the pan, just like that, so it doesn't stick. You can use butter too, a little bit of butter if you don't want to use like a, like a spray. And we have our pancake batter. Don't, you don't want to, remember it's going to spread, you know, so don't put too much in there because then you're going to run the risk of, here you go, Gerard, um, you're going to run the risk of um, overfilling your pan, right? and also run the risk of like the pancake not cooking properly too, right Jerome? Yes. Um, so while we've got the pancakes going here, um, you know, you'll be able to tell too like when it's ready to flip because you're going to see it coming off the sides bubble a little bit. You're going to see it's going to bubble in the middle, it's going to sort of come off the sides. See Gerard's is already bubbling, his is going a little faster than mine. And then here what we have with the bananas foster is one of Gerard's favorite things to make because he drinks a little and a little for him, a little for the thing. So Gerard, you want to talk about this? Uh, banana foster. It's uh, some uh, d uh, hip dark brown sugar, some apple juice, butter. You just, uh, uh, when you put the sugar in, the butter, you let it melt, it dissolves. Deglaze with a little rum? With a little rum and then uh, apple juice and heavy cream. The apple juice keeps it from uh, caramelizing again, so which is important, yeah. And that's it, real simple. Yeah. yeah and flavorful. So you can make this like ahead of time too, you know, and you can make like a larger batch of it for your home. I think this is like on back here, something's on. Um, and you can make like a larger batch and just put it in your fridge because this will last like up to, you know, two or three days like that. And then just warm it up every morning when you have breakfast, you know. Um, so you're not making it every single day. So all right, my pancake is, see, look, it just comes off. I don't even need a spatula. See, it's flipping, it's like moving around in the pan. And ready? Ready, ready to flip, one, two. Boom. Oh, look at that, beautiful. So um, that's the sign of like one, having a pan that's good and it's not sticking. And two, when it's ready to be flipped, it'll just tell you that it's ready. All right. So same thing will happen on the other side. It'll when once it releases from the pan and starts to get a nice crust, it'll come off. It'll it'll come off on its own. See, Gerard's is already coming off. Mine's almost there. So now let's talk. Let's move on to the tres leches um, sauce here uh, that we have. And basically, tres leches, you know, for those of you that can't figure it out, means uh, three milk. Um, and so the three milks that we use in here is condensed milk, uh, evaporated milk and a little bit of uh, whole milk too, or sometimes and whipped cream. So um, all together, a little bit of rum in here too, right, George? Here, George, do you want yours ready? You can put it on that plate right there. I think mine's ready too. You can put mine on there too. Um, yeah, so what you want to do with this is, the um, best way to do it is probably in your, in your KitchenAid, you know, um, put it all together and whip it up really well. So I'm going to whip it up a little bit. And you can get it as stiff as you want. This will get pretty stiff. Um, obviously, it's going to take me a little while and like hands going to hurt. So I'm going to pretend like we have this like super whipped up. Or you know what? Sometimes we leave it like nice and runny like that too and soft. So it's really up to you uh, because either way, even if you do whip it up really stiff, as soon as you put that hot pancake on it, it's going to melt anyway. So. We're going to put that on the bottom of the plate. 
just like that. And Gerard's going to put the pancakes on top. Center. Right in the center of it. And then for the big finish, it's going to be this delicious caramelized bananas. Just like that. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Look at that. And then you want to grab some strawberries, Gerard. Um, and then, you know, just because we're being so gluttonous and so with all this cream and rum so early in the morning, we want to pretend like we're not alcoholics and, um, and a bunch of unhealthy people. So we'll put some fresh fruit in there too just to keep people happy. And a little powdered sugar. And that's it, and that's our Tres Leches pancakes. Really easy stuff. Are you, are you videotaping me yeah, eating, what, what, eating Webby? That's just stupid. <laughs> People want to see that. <laughs> I have to see your face, your reaction. I need a right? mimosa or something. I, we have that too. Oh, you're waiting for my reaction? <laughs> oh, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs>